Hey guys, so in this video, I'm gonna be talking about the seven mistakes that cause pain and health challenges to last longer than they should. We often get asked at Life Balance Chiropractic, give us an understanding of why people are chronically stressed and anxious, but also living with unresolved physical pain and it lasting longer than it should, stealing quality of life and actually causing this lack of mobility and making people more risk averse. And so why are people so frustrated? Well, to answer this, we see that there are six main glitches or thinking mistakes that people are having that cause the wrong action, which creates the problems in the first place. First of all, number one is that they lack awareness and think it will go away on its own. And so, you know, they often minimize or try to ignore it and will just power on through. And so what they're really lacking here is a clear or correct clinical impression of what's going on with their body. And that's either because they've not been listened to, been heard or had the extra time to discover more about their body to guide on that hands assessment and really understand their specific needs and wants. Number two is that they lack commitment and reasons. They have been told lots of different things. They're frustrated, they've been told to rest, they've been tried try these uh, medications and just, you know, this exercise, do this thing and see how it goes. And so number three is that they lack results. They've tried other health professionals, but nothing they said or did helped to correct the problem long term. And here really what they're lacking is function as their spine isn't moving properly or in the correct alignment. And there's no accountability or support. And really what this does is it leads to the wrong action mistakes. And they procrastinate. And so they don't make the time. They just try to figure it out on their own. Or they get it wrong and they make it worse. Does this sound familiar? Because what ends up happening is they end up suffering for longer than they need to or they just end up accepting it as a way of life. They end up not doing and trying those things anymore or doing those things because they just didn't get the result they wanted. They end up just learning to live with it, accepting it as part of life, as if it's just normal or it's just the way it is. And you know, maybe they've tried those exercises that just made it 10 times worse or they just don't do that anymore. And it's sad because, you know, the amount of times in my own clients in my practice where I hear this beforehand, it's really sad. And it's rarely the best practice because, you know, often weeks, months later, you know, that person's going back to their health provider and it hasn't gotten better. Worse, they're often given, you know, maybe a more stronger prescription or they're advised maybe more rest and you know this is madness and explains why so many people are suffering longer than they need to and why people end up so frustrated as to who they should see when they're struggling with these problems and so i hope this video was helpful um, just to give some context around really the thinking mistakes that we see in our practice and the action mistakes as a result of that thinking so that you can become more aware so that you can we can empower you to help yourself um, if you have, if you have any comments uh, of your own experiences with this uh, of your own thinking you know leave them below we'd love to hear them um, you know t t today and now is the time to be vulnerable so yeah please leave them below leave your comments and uh Thank you for watching. See you in the next one.